hello D Rock here. Welcome to the channel and Buenos Dias. Jen is with me. Hello. We have returned to Otter Creek. It is almost mid September. We have turned the corner with the heat. Nice cool morning out here. High is supposed to be 81. Light winds. Light winds. What do you think? <laughs> we'll see at noon, right? Anyway. Since our last visit here, someone has caught a 12 pound rainbow trout. Talking to the guy at the uh, entrance this morning, someone caught, was it a 12 pound wiper? Yeah. A 12 pound wiper this morning. That's right, wiper 12 pound off power bait. And we want to catch some fish today, obviously. So we're gonna troll and do our usual thing and uh, hopefully we can connect with some sizable fish. So join us and if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe, because why not? All right, so. We we're gonna try trolling really slow, like at two miles an hour, maybe under or maybe just over. And we're gonna see what that brings us. Jin just got a hit. I had brought a GPS, so I wanted to get my speed matched to my RPMs, so since my speedometer doesn't work, and uh, we'll see where it goes from there. What? Fish on? Did you really? Huh. All right, well, I failed to mention, we're using, we're starting out with shad wraps, these small ones, I think they're number sevens, so they go to about nine, ten feet. Uh, both of us have those on, but different patterns. Jen is uh, the craw, bright orange color, and mine is a more white color. So Jen's had two strikes on hers already. And we are going right at about two miles an hour. Fish on? Fish on. Really? Hot oh, damn. Look at you go. Get out of here. Pretty good size. Yeah? Oh, look at you, Jen. Oh Heck no! Yeah, that's the way to do it. Not start. Oh, look at that! Digging it. Good catch, Jen. Thank you. Yeah. Good catch, Jen. Thank you. Wow. We're not getting skunked, are we? I know we are. It's all good. Nice. All right. There's all my shad wraps. I'm gonna switch to just one size larger. This craw pattern that Jen's using. So if she got a hit on that. Then I want to try that. All right. I'm right at two miles an hour now. Already got one in the boat. We're both using the shad wraps. She's number seven, I'm number five. Same pattern, so. Let's see if we can get another one. You got two hits before you landed that one, didn't you? All right, man. Hey, Sean. Again. Yeah. Nice, Jim. Oh. Where'd he come up at? <laughs> he's he's fed up in here. Oh, that's another nice one, Jen. Man. Oh, that's... Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that one. Yeah, he's oh, nice. Oh, <laughs> nice catch. Thanks. Why don't you release some line there and get him in the water. There we go. Wow, that's a nice one, Jen. Oh, look at that. Good catch, Jen. Good catch. <laughs> All right, let's get him back in there, huh? Maybe if he wasn't on, you know? What, the strike? Yeah. Seemed like he hit it, then he was he off, then he it, came and back. It almost seemed like he was off, and then he came back, so maybe. Then he, he launched. Yeah. yeah, he did. <laughs> Love it, man. All right, I'm going to actually go to back to a smaller Rapala here, a different pattern. This is a CD7. You just got a hit? Good <laughs> lord. Uh, unbelievable. And uh, this goes down to about eight feet, so we're going to give this one a shot. Uh, we started out with some action. Jen got two in the boat, multiple hits. I got a couple hits, but now it's... Uh, it has dropped. Not much happening, so 
just going to continue to troll along here. We're in about 22 feet of water and we're going maybe two miles an hour. So hopefully we get into them again. Those are some nice sized rainbows you pulled in earlier. It's a good way to start the day. Taking a break to have a little chicken and hot sauce. Nothing else is happening, right, Jen? Not right now. We are in a slow spot. You just got a hit? I did. Yep. Well, that's encouraging. We haven't had a, a hit in, what, almost an hour? Yeah. Getting hits again. We're not connecting though. I just had one for a second, felt like a nice one, and lost it. We're still just heading up the reservoir, chugging along, and we're staying in about 17 18 feet of water. And by the way, the water temperature is 66.6 degrees. <laughs> about that so not too hot should be just about right I guess yeah I guess I don't know but uh, the action really dropped off from when we first launched I thought we were gonna have epicness we'll still have it but the day yes days days not over we're just at that noonish lull, lull yeah breeze is starting to pick up a little bit that's good so let's see what happens big, big fish eh? okay all right it's got a big fish on it all right oh, no i'm stuck on that rod okay oh yeah whoa okay i'm right here wow what do you got jen oh my goodness that's a big fish Oh my god. Oh, Jim. Good lord. <laughs> you got it. Yes, look at this thing. Holy crap. Oh. It's hard to reel in. Hold that. <laughs> wow. Look at my fish. It's giant. Oh, there we go. I'm like shaking. <laughs> Jen, that is a big, big Rambo. It is. We're going to let him rest for a second because we definitely want you to hold him up. <laughs> wow. Whew. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> you all right? Yeah, my heart's beating super fast. <laughs> scared to bring him out. Oh, my goodness. Look how big this fish is. I'll just keep the net underneath him. Wow, Jen. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> Good catch, Jen. Yeah. Good catch. Alright, let's get him back in the net for a second. Right. He's right at 20 inches. Nice. Right, let's get him right there. How you feel, Jen? <laughs> well, I'm starting to calm down. <laughs> I feel great. That was awesome. Did you see that fish? Of course I saw that fish. <laughs> 20 inch rainbow, that's nothing to laugh at there, man. That is, that is banging. You gotta get us a scale, I wonder how much you weigh. Uh, I have a scale, but it's, uh, I don't have it on the boat, it's in the other, um, yeah, I blew it. Anyway. It's all right, I got it. That was worth a while. Let's bring that lure over, let's see what you hit on. That was it, huh? All right, I'm going back to this pattern, a little larger size, see if something we can make happen again. Right on, Jen. Boom. <laughs> All right, back at it. So I just put on another shad wrap in the pattern Jen's using, except it's just a little bit larger. And uh, I want to point out also that uh, I switched out all our leaders from 10 pound fluorocarbon to 15 pound in anticipation of larger fish. So definitely don't want to lose them for that reason. So that worked out well. See if we can get another one, huh? Fish on? Still? Yeah. You still got him? Yeah, I got him. <laughs> Good lord, Jen. You gonna let me catch your fish today? How are we looking? Bring him over here. Oh, watch the motor. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, he's got some fight in him, huh? Yeah. Oh, man. That's another nice one, Jen. Oh, I got you. Wow. Let's have a look at this one. Oh. Yeah. Man, they're so strong, you know? Yeah. Nice, healthy fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice, Jen. Good catching. This one's taking a beating. As you can see, it's already been, it's already broken the back here. So uh, hopefully that's not going to make a difference at the speed we're trolling. So I've just moved that wire back in. And Jen, killing him with this thing. I know, right? We're starting to get a breeze now, a nice light breeze. <laughs> yeah. Supposed to blow like nine. It means 15 out here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's never not windy except in the morning. Anyway, uh, we're getting, looks like we're getting to the end, the north end of the reservoir here. So, we just a little bit longer than turn, our, turn around and head back the other way, see if we can catch another 20 incher. That would be sweet. Solid breeze now, and we're turning around and heading back to the south. The other end of the reservoir before we started. I just got a nice hit. No fish. <laughs> All right, we're on another long, slow stretch, huh? Nothing, not a hit. Not. Breeze. Hope we come across something soon. Break the monotony. All right, well, we haven't had any luck in about 30 minutes or so, so we're gonna switch lures. Jen's gonna go with the rattle trap. This is a sunrise perch. And then I'm gonna try this Metsu, I believe it's called. This is go kind of deep. It's bright, chromy, something. Still nothing. It turned off in a big way. No hits or anything the last hour. Nothing. Nothing. Nada. Nothing. The reservoir has come down quite a bit since our last trip, which I think was in July. A lot less water. And it's my rod tip. There's a truck right there. And he's buried to his axles. Bad day. I mean, he is sunk. Oh. Oh, that's a drag. Speaking of drags, we haven't had a hit. Nothing. I mean, it is just shut down. Mm. Don't know what to say. We'll keep at it for a little while longer. All right, well, sometimes you got to go big. So I'm gonna go for this big shad wrap. This is the, what number is this? This is the number nine. That's what, four inches there, I think. And that'll go down quite a bit. So we're in 20 feet of water now. What do you think, Jen? Something's gotta work. Something's gotta work. I mean, I oh yeah. Looks like we got some stuff down in the graph there. I mean, I'd hit that, you know, if I saw that come on by me. All right, we're going to make a broad circle and turn back and troll to the ramp. Yeah, Jen just got a hit, but still nothing. It's just turned off. Maybe we can pick one up on the way back. Well, you win some and you lose some. Today just wasn't my day. However, it was my day. <laughs> yeah, it was. Good job today, Jim. <laughs> we came here looking for a big trot and we got it. A 20 inch rainbow certainly made the trip worth it. Yeah. So, it's a tough nut to crack today. Uh, started out good, then it dropped, then we got into it again, and then it dropped and never picked back up. But, we got lots of hits. Yeah. I mean, lots of hits. And, 
controlled as slow as possible, right around two miles per hour. I couldn't go any slower, otherwise I'd just be in neutral. So uh, we still couldn't connect, or at least I couldn't. Jim pretty much stuck with uh, this one here. That's the small one, and she did very well on that. I tried quite a few different shad wraps, sizes, and uh, patterns, and I got hits on all of them, but I couldn't connect. That's fishing for you. You just that's why you keep coming back. But we did accomplish what we came here for, and that was a big trout. So good job on that, Jen. Yeah, absolutely. Anyway, folks, thank you for watching Tight Lines. If you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. Support for the channel is greatly appreciated. We'll see you next time, folks. D-Rock out. Ciao. Adios.